Hey guys, welcome to Crazy Take. And today in this video, I'm gonna flash Android Nougat on my Lenovo K3 Note. As you can see, this is Lenovo K3 Note, and I'm using Android Marshmallow right now. So I have downloaded the Nougat file and have put it inside the external SD card. So you have to download these three zip files from the below description link. Go to that website and download it one by one. So these are the files, the ROM file, the GApps file and a update package. So that's it. Now you should have uh, a custom recovery installed like TWRP or CMW. For me, TWRP is installed. So let's power off the device and go to that TWRP recovery. Press volume up, volume down and power key at the same time. And when it vibrates, just release the power key and it will automatically go inside the TWRP recovery. So this is the TWRP recovery. So let me adjust the brightness because it's too much bright. Now, first of all, you have to go to the wipe section and just have to go to the format data section and you have to format the data. That means factory reset. So, so as you can see, factory reset is done. Now you have to go to the advanced wipe section and here you have to select the cache, cache and data and swipe to wipe. So all are wiped. Now let's go back and we have to now go to the install section, go to the install section and here you have to select the external SD card. And as you can see, there are three files, EOSVK3 node, 7.1 to zip. Just click on it and swipe to install it. So it will take a couple of minutes. So to save your valuable time, I'm just skipping this video. And as you can see, the ROM is successfully flashed now. Just go back and flash the update 7 zip, which is the fix, I would say. Swipe to install it. Now it's successfully flashed, and now let's go back and you have to flash the GApps file, which is the Pico version of GApps. So just swipe to install it. See, finally GFs are flashed and just go to that wipe section and wipe the cache and just reboot your system. If it asks for super so just click on do not install because it's already in there. If you do that, it might break your phone. So save from it. So as you can see, the boot animation is looking really cool, I would say. So let's see how much time it take. It may take over uh, five minutes. So I'm going to skip this video to save your valuable time. And guys, as you can see, this is the cool animations of Google. So let's go and do the first setup. So finally, as you can see, Android Nougat is here and really, is it Nougat? Let's check. As you can see, the notifications, bars, animations is from Nougat. Also, the notifications are from Nougat. Let's go to the settings and go to the about phone. And as you can see in the about phone, it's saying 7.1 Android version. That means it's Nougat, as you can see. So K3 Note is getting Nougat. I don't know if it will get officially but I hope that it will get official update of Android Nougat also custom rock is um, now available so that's a great news for K3 Note users for all the performance the fluidity is amazing it's really really smooth and fluid 
so that's it pretty much for this video guys if you have any specific questions regarding uh, this room kindly do let me let me know in the comment section below please ask your questions and i will definitely try to answer you so yeah that's it pretty much for this video guys hope you liked it if you liked it do hit that like button and for more videos like this do hit the subscribe button thank you guys for watching